a video for you today, not on the guitar, but on this amplifier. It is a Fender Mustang GTX 100 that is available right now on the Rimmers Music website, rimmersmusic.co.uk. If you're watching on our YouTube channel, you can find the links to this amplifier in the description below this video that will take you over to our website where you can see some more pictures of it, see the price, and hopefully decide to make one yours. So, what is Fender Mustang? Well, they're an amplifier that have been around for quite some time now, but this is the most current, up-to-date version of it. So it's the GTX. So Mustang GTX 100, they also do a GTX 50. It's a little bit smaller and it's only 50 watts. This is 100 watts. With the 100 watts, Fender have got in mind that you're gonna gig with it. So that's the main thing, and it is a gig-worthy amp. The volume that I've got at the moment is a quarter of the way up, so it can really drive it. For live use, it's brilliant. The samples that are in it, the sounds, they're amazing. They really are. The tones that you've got at your fingertips with this amplifier is brilliant. I'm going to put the guitar down for now, and I'm just going to talk to you a little bit about it, and I'm going to move, as you can see, I've got an iPad here. I'm going to move that closer to the camera so you can see what's really going on with this amplifier. So as you can see from the front of it, there's no controls. The controls are here on the back. So the controls are set up with a master, a reverb, a bass, a middle, a treble, a volume, and a gain. There's an LED screen here, or an LCD screen uh, here, which you can control. It's slightly different than this. It doesn't have a picture of an amplifier and pedals on it. It's, so it's slightly different. And then you've got a main master knob. So you can control the amp in two ways. You can control it with just the amp, that you don't need any other devices, or you can download an app. It's Bluetooth, this amplifier. So you can download a Fender app, which is free to download, and then you can control the amplifier from the app, which is brilliant. It makes life so, so much easier. It really, really does. I'm gonna move it closer in a moment. This amplifier comes with a pedal as well, just so you're aware. It comes with this, which is a Fender uh, GTX, 50, uh, GTX 7 pedal. So you've got on here the ability to recall your presets so for live use it's metal so it is designed for live use it's solid construction which is good it's got a tuner the tuner's nice you step on the tuner button it cuts the amplifier off so for live use that's handy the amplifier has got a looper built into it as well so you can switch the looper on and off that's just a really nice feature with the gtx 100 it doesn't come with the gtx 50 the pedal that's an optional extra so 100 watts Bluetooth capability, put headphones in it as well, so you can use it for silent play. And because it's not valved, because it's a digital amplifier, it sounds great at low volume. So for home use, as much as it is 100 watts, you can take it home and you can use it at home. It gives you that ability because you still keep the tone at low volume. With a valve amp, if you're not aware of valve amp, you have to, like this little Pro Junior I've got here, you have to drive it quite low, you have to turn the volume quite high up on it to get the tone out of it. So for home use, it's not always that practical. But with this, this is very, very practical. It makes playing at home and, and getting your sound right so that you can then go and play live, you can reuse with it. It's just very versatile. Right, I'm going to move closer to the camera so you can see what's going on with this app because it is brilliant. So the app is, like I say, it's free to download. And hopefully, you should be able to see that. I think I positioned that just right, maybe too far away. I'm not quite sure. It's hard to judge. I'm on my own at the moment. So, what you've got here with this, so you download the app and go straight into it. It's connected to the amplifier via Bluetooth. And here on the left hand side are all the 200 presets. So, it's 200 presets which have been designed by Fender themselves. So, Fender have basically give you a, a groundwork. To, to change, to, to, to stay with, to do whatever you want with it. So the, this is the 200 patches that you've got here to move through. And you can also move through them by just flicking up here. So that's another way of moving through the different presets that Fender have done. Now, what is super cool about this is the fact that when you land on a preset, so I've landed on Beck Ended, which I would say that that is a Jeff Beck tone to me, uh, Beck. <laughs> I would say it's Jeff Beck. It's a 60s style amp, so it's probably going to be a, a Jeff Becky type sound. So, what I can do with this amplifier that's there at the moment, I click on that, it loads up this screen here, which allows me to change everything. So, if for example, I don't like the preset, I don't like the treble, I want a bit more, I want to get it to eight, I can get it to eight. I 
can get it to eight point five. Whatever I want, I can do it. I can go back and it's changed it on here, but it also changes if I move the actual knob on the screen as well, which is very, very cool. So there's two ways of doing it. You can either flick it, change it, or do it on the screen, whichever you prefer to do. Now, what's very, very cool is I can change that amp. If I press the amp button there, it allows me to go through the 40 different amps that are built into this amplifier. Fender have sampled a 57 Bandmaster, a 57 Champ, a 57 Deluxe, a 65 Deluxe, 65 Twim, all sorts, Acoustasonics, bass breakers. There's a Blues Junior been sampled, so you can have the Blues Junior in this. So you can have whatever you want. It really is. So I didn't like that amp, so I want to change it. I want to change it to a 59 Bassman. So I click on the 59 Bassman and I press Done. And as you can, as you can see, it's changed. The amplifier is now a 59 Bassman. So I'm still on the back ended, but I've changed the amp. I've, I've wanted to change it. So I want to change the tones on it. So I go into treble and I change the treble. I want to go and change, let's say the presence there. Because it's such a big amplifier, you can move it as well. So I want to change the presence, take a bit more up there on that one, come back. Now, that's the amp. So I've done the amp, I'm, ha I'm happy with that. I've done my sounds. That's what I want from the amplifier. Now, what I want to be able to do is change the effects. So I'm looking at this effect and I'm thinking, right, it's a mono tap delay, tape delay. I want to change it. So I might want to do this. I might want to move that up and down. Or I might want to get rid of it completely. I might want to say, do you know what? I don't want that. I'm going to delete it. It's gone. That's it. Go back to my main screen and it's gone. I've removed it. So now what I can do is I can go into the effects and I can select any effect that I want. So I can move through. There's loads of different effects. There's vibratos, there's flanges, tremolos, choruses, delays. I can add anything. Space delay. So let's click on space delay, for example. Press done. I've added space delay to my setup. So a space delay pedal's there. I can switch it on and off. Just like with a normal pedal, instead of touching it with your foot, or you doing it with your hand. And I can tweak everything. I can change the delay time. Moved it, changed it. Then I've got this other pedal here. So I've got a large hall reverb. So I'm thinking, I want, maybe I want to change it. I want to change that, I want to get rid of that. I want to change that and put that back. So let's have a look here. Let's have another reverb pedal. So let's go down to the reverbs. Let's have, shall we have, shall we have, Small room reverb. There we go. You can have whatever you want. You can customize this amplifier to do whatever you want it to do. Then what I can do is I can save it. It syncs up with the amplifier. It's saving that sound and it's done it. So if I move off back ended now and go into Black Magic, the Black Magic is there, but I go back to that and it's as I saved it. So I could I've got that. It's customized. It's saved as well I want it and I can always recall that sound. It is absolutely brilliant. Another feature that you can do, where it says downloaded here at the bottom, these are all sounds that people have downloaded themselves and created and uploaded, should I say, onto the Fender website, so you can get these tones. So people, you can do the same. You can create your own sound and think, right, I've got this sound. I wanna put it out there for everybody to have. You can try it, you can add it, like a what's what's that Jimmy V? What's he done there? Overdrive, genre, life is beautiful, Nashville gospel, fly fuzz, any of these, try them, see what's out there. But your presets are here, so you've saved them, you've done what you want to do with them. There we go. It is literally as simple as that. I'm gonna move back now to the amplifier. So I'm gonna. I'm going to let you have a listen to some tones. Hopefully, fingers crossed, you could see what was going on there on the screen. So I'm going to pop that back on there now. Like I say, you don't have to use that. You can literally just use, a, uh, use the amp itself. You can use your smartphone. You can use an iPad. Whatever you've got, Bluetooth, connected, Android, iOS. The option is there for you. So let's have a look here. Now, I'm probably not going to use that tone that I just created because it was a bit unusual <laughs> just showing you what there was available. So what's what we got? Let's have a, a flick through all the different sounds that are in here. What have we got? Oh, there's all sorts. Van flanger, bass breaker sounds, super 90s sonic gains, vibro king. What's the vibro king like? <laughs> sound 
that is a great sample of a vibro king. If you've ever heard one or played with one, that is really, really good. All digitally created, but it sounds brilliant. The spank is there. Brilliant. What else have we got here? 57 Bandmaster, what's this like? Presets. The presets alone, without you even going into it and editing them, sound really cool. What's this spoon for? <laughs> So it's a 70s British, so it's, it's an imitation of a Marshall head. And what's the pedal we've got with this? A large room reverb. I don't think you even need to change anything. Like that sounds amazing. Brilliant. Let's have a look here what else there is. Purple rain. Ooh, that's a nice that. just phenomenal and there's 200 of these presets so if whatever you're into it's gonna cover it for you you've got all sorts of different stuff in here I'm gonna just show you what else we got here so <laughs> Oh, my God. 
sorts of stuff in this amplifier there we go i've skimmed the surface hopefully you have enjoyed this video and it's been helpful fender mustang gtx 100 available at rimmers music right now if you're watching on youtube thank you very much for watching don't forget to subscribe to the rimmers music youtube channel there's videos coming every single day now on all sorts of different products pianos keyboards guitars guitar amps new products used products x display products We've got you covered here at Rimmers Music. Head over to our website, have a look what we do. And thank you for the likes as well. We do appreciate them. That's really nice. So thank you. And there we go. You guys take care. And I will no doubt see you soon. Bye-bye.